Hello. Good morning. Good afternoon. Good evening, everyone. Her is teacher Elena. So, by the way, uh, some of my friends advised me that my channel is too long, so I must change it. That's why that the title of my channel is Korean Study with Elena. So, today we're going to talk about uh, the things in the kitchen that uh, we usually use it. So, I advise you guys, if you really want to learn Korean, you must uh, study or learn and memorize uh, 10 words every day. And then after that, you're gonna uh, use to it. And it's just very easy to learn Korean from you. So today we're going to talk about uh, things in the kitchen. So example, this one, this one is very common. You're gonna use this one. So Korean for this one is Chopse, chopse. Okay, number one. Chopse. So it means a plate. Okay, it's a plate. So uh, usually Koreans uh, didn't use a big plate in their kitchen. They use a very small one. So this one is plate. Number two, you can have the chopstick. So Korean people use a chopstick. Okay, we call this one chukara. But in writing, there is a siyut under it. Okay, chukara, chopstick, chukara, chukara, chukara. Okay, next number two, we have this uh, cup, cup. So it is English, but uh, Korean uh, use a lot of uh, Konglish or English in words, but they just write it in Korean. So this one is cup, cup, cup. Okay. Okay, cup. All right. Next, number four. Uh, Korean people use a small rice bowl. So we call this one pop kurut. Pop kurut. Pop kurut. Pop means rice. Kurut means bowl. That's why. We call this one pop kurut, pop kurut. Okay, this one pop kurut, pop kurut, pop kurut. Okay, rice bowl. Right, number five. Uh, it's a very uh, confusing between these two: the uh, spoon and chopstick. The, the, it almost sounds the same, but remember that uh, the chopstick should uh, cut up, and then this one is sut cut up, Okay, I'll write this one. This one is sut So, uh, Korean people use this one to, uh, you know, drinking or eating uh, uh, the soup. So we usually, uh, Western people or Asian, other Asian use this one, like in America and the Philippines, we use this one to eat rice, but uh, Korean people use this one for more on soup. Next, uh, we gonna have this uh, fork, fork, but this one is like uh, same, it's an English word, but Korean uh, use it in the same way, but we write it in a Korean way. So this one, poku. Poku, poku, okay. Poku, poku, okay. Poku, fork is poku. Okay, next, uh, next or is uh this one? This one is uh, kukurut, So uh, Korean people use a small uh, soup bowl for their soup. So uh. Kurut means bowl, kuk means a soup. So we call this one kukurut. 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 Okay. Kukurut. Okay. Kukurut. Kukurut. Right. Next. Uh, you couldn't, uh, you know, you couldn't uh, slice. Anything if you don't have this 
chopping board or cutting board. Cutting board or chopping board, we call this one toma. Toma. Okay. Next, uh, we have this one. Uh, this one is uh, also English word, but uh, we call this one wine glass. Wine glass, so uh, we call this one wine jan. Jan means uh, used for drinking. Okay, or so this one is wine jan. Wine jan. Wine jan. Wine jan. Wine jan. Wine jan. Okay, wine glass, wine jan, or wine glass. Next, uh, last, uh, we call this one is glass, glass, so yeah, glass used for drinking. So we have this in Korean, yuri jan, yuri jan, yuri jan, okay. Yuri means glass, jan means used for drinking, so we call this one yuri jan. So guys, let's have a recap. So today we talk about uh, things in the kitchen. So first we have this chokse, chokse, chokse. Okay, with this plate. Number two, chutkarak, chutkarak. It means chopstick. Number three, cup, cup, cup means cup in English. Papkrut, papkrut, papkrut means rice bowl. Number five, sutkarak, sutkarak, sutkarak means fork. Number six, poku, poku, poku means fork. And then seven, kukurut, kukurut. It means uh, rice, uh, this one, or this wine, kukurut, the uh, soup bowl. Number eight, tuma, 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 chopping board. Wine jan, wine jan, wine jan. This one is a wine glass. Then yuri jan, yuri jan means this one is a uh, uh, glass okay guys thank you for today i hope you learned something from me so please don't forget to like uh, subscribe and share with my video okay thank you very much have a good day bye